Hello everyone, my name is Sinner and we've got something new for you today. However, before we get into the video, I'd like to take a moment to tell you that nearly 70% of people who watch our videos are not subscribed. If you're not subscribed, you could do me a huge favor by liking the video, commenting below, subscribing to the channel, and ringing that bell. It really helps with the channel and lets me know that you're liking what I'm making. Alright, without further ado, let's get into the video. Do I, do I have to go back? The entrance to make it spawn or something? Is it up here? I just didn't realize. Is it back here and I didn't realize? Is this where it is? I literally don't care about any of this. I just care about a certain item. Okay, special roundtable hold can purchase those guys after smithing stone miners ball bearings can be obtained from the boss crystalline Ray Lucaria crystal tone. This is the right one, right? Did I go to the wrong one? I'm guessing I went to the wrong one. Okay, whatever. Um, okay, it's a different one. So, okay, whatever. Let's just go and... Uh, this one. So let's just go over there then. Now we can get there relatively quick from here, I think. I think. Yeah, I think it's here ish. Let's teleport here so we can just go over there and fight one of them. Put on our proper stuff. Let's switch back to our swift. Let's get on torrent and let's make our way over to this other dungeon. So that we can unlock buying the upgrades. As soon as this shit's over with, the sooner I can get back to the actual game itself. As soon as this shit's over with, the sooner I don't have to farm those items, I can just buy them. Alright, so the fucking cave. It's over there? Good. Oh, 
Well, the other kid was nice because it has sorcery in it that we could use. I guess it's a silver lining. Okay, so where's the spot of good? Where's the side of grace? There. Okay, sounds good. So, let's go do this one instead. But before that, I'm taking a break, because fuck this! Alright, so... We made a slight change. We use a hammer now. A uh, club, club we started with. And instead of our dagger, hopefully that will... Because that will do strike damage, so we'll see. Let's see what's down here. Something we can collect. Cracked crystals. Interesting. Okay, and this is going up, and I remember there was something over there. Maybe. No, it was over there. And it was over here. Okay. Is that it? Ah, oh, that's it. Okay. Why is it always in the oh, wall? Yeah. Yes. Jumping indeed. Okay. So. Let's go see what we can do. Yes. Okay. Whew. There's an enemy behind us. Okay, not a mimic. What is that? Somber smithing stones. Dolce. If you're curious, because upgrades, upgrades only go because you're. Yeah. So upgrades in this game go up to 25 now. So uh, that's why they're not calling them like small, light, large, very mar very large. Because they'd have to come up with all these different all these different words that will vary across. That will vary across different languages, so it's just easier for them to not bother. Nice. Take those, that's a bottomless bit. Let's go ahead and backstab him. Kill him that way. <clears throat> Good shit. Okay, they dropped Smithing Stone Mark Twos. Okay, is this a thing? Oh, a jumping puzzle, eh? Alright then. I'm down. Need to run for this one. Okay. And what do we get? Somber smithing stones. Oh, rank three? No. Nice. Alright, let's go. So we did that little jumping puzzle. Yep, got those guys. Let's get an idol. Could it be an invisible wall? And there's a shortcut, most likely, to the end of the level. 
so that works. Now, what is what is over here? Okay. It seems that because we're using a blown weapon, it's easier to make them stagger. Right, stamina back. Let's heal real quick. Let's just carry and slicer them to death. Just easier. Ow. Go. I've got those guys. Glitstone stra scraps. Okay. First, I thought they. At first, I thought it was glintstone strap. You know, this dude is blood grit. They just, you know, just like. <laughs> Blooded strap. So doing some research, if you have cold spells, then these guys are evidently weak. This, those uh, big things were are evidently weak to cold spells. Those big crystal dudes. Okay, so what is over here? So there's a light over there, so that's probably a place we can get to. Okay, let's see. Enough. You can see it from up there. Works for me. Okay, so... Nah, how do we get down? Do we get down? Is there a place we jump to? No, I think this is just you die. That seems a bit far. We can't go back up. So, alright, sounds good. Wow. And we have no other choice but to just try it. We're gonna die. Now we won't die. Okay then, if you say so. So, it is this way? This is going back to where we came from. Uh, yeah, I think so. So let's pull it just so we do, so we have it, just in case we need it. And let's... <clears throat> move forward. So he is going to attack us the moment he can. If 
your chair. Well, he's got that larger strap this time. It's a shotgun. <laughs> Is it still called a strap if it's a shotgun? I literally don't know. It's a slang I'm aware of, but don't actually know. <laughs> Goodbye. A digger's sap. I remember that being. I remember reading somewhere that, that was really good. Okay, we have been here before. So, we'll just make our way down. Now let's go. Okay, well we fought we fought the harder option. Alright, sounds good. Die. Okay, so those are probably going to come to life too. Relatively soon. So what's over here? Smithing stone. Okay. Oh no. Okay, sounds good. Just fires in literally every direction. <laughs> That's kind of ridiculous. I kind of like it. Is there anyone over here? Marionette soldiers. Out there? No. And what about further up there? Okay, well, I can kill one of these real quick. One, two. One, two. Dual chain. Crystal knife, huh? That isn't quite what we need right now, so we're going to not even worry about it. Okay, those dudes are below us. Gotcha. Oh, nice. We got it. How's it doing? Ooh. Yeah. Yeah, we can use it. Oh, that's right, it explodes. Anyway, let's kill him. These guys are being good employees and not paying attention to anything else, except for just doing their jobs, I like it. Too bad that's not necessarily a good plan right now. Diggers stains. I have a feeling that when I attack one of them, they will all aggro. Hello, guys. Oh, nice. <laughs> that works.
Shatter Earth. Okay, we're gonna have to look at these new sorcerers that we've gotten. That we have uh, found. Because it would be nice to have uh, stronger sorcerers, I suppose. Marionette soldiers there, so that works. Ah, oh, shit. <laughs> like when you're doing a jumping puzzle, and you just hear, oh shit, you just know. <laughs> so we're gonna be seeing a loading screen soon. I mean, on one hand, that gives us an opportunity to uh, get more of those. On the downside, we can pull that lift back up, so uh, we're going to have to do that. Come on, man. If you really want to go, we can go. Does he fall to his death? Because <laughs> that would be funny. Alright, let's go. All we need to do is run. We just out need to outrun their aggro. Oh no. I think we were over here. So let's go. Okay, so Grandpa's coming after us. Okay, good. We gotta sit back. So this is the boss fight. I actually don't know what this boss fight is, but let's I think I know what it is. Okay, so you've got one of those. You throw chakra. Do you also go oh, no 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 <laughs> Okay, very nice. No, we should just backstab him to death. Oh. I want to point out this this club is not upgraded. And um, we're not actually started out to use it. We don't have shrug yet, otherwise I'd just use shrug. Um <laughs> Okay, so let's uh see what else is it down here. Is this it? I think we came in over there. There's nothing over here. Okay, so we got that bell. Is this an item? No. Okay, so let's go back to the entrance. 
then we will go back to the round table. Then we'll buy a bunch of smithing stones and uh, go have them be upgraded. Go upgrade our stat. So let's do that. <laughs> yeah, if you use a blown weapon, they pretty much just die. If you use magic, um, have fun. Good luck with that. There you go. And so now she sells infinite glintstone scrap. As well as smithing stones. But we have four now. And she sells three of these. Or twice what the other guys sell them for. So that can work. Let's go over here to blacksmith. And see what we can do with our staff. She's gonna upgrade our staff a little bit. Well, I took you for no matter it. Lay out your arms. Okay. Oh, we need six of those. Okay, well, we will be there. Because <clears throat> we have a lot. We have some cash to use. Okay, let's go, and then, then we'll find out how much we need to further upgrade it, and we'll see if we can buy those as well. And then we can get our staff up there. That'll be great. Got it. Back already. No matter. Back already. Okay. All right. Then. Do this to four, and that requires two rows. No, two. Yeah, two rows. Then four. And then six. All right. Now we need smith and stone three. We got two, and then four, and then we're good. It's plus nine now. Uh, but yeah, the sorcery scaling seems to go up a little bit each time. But I. Now we got some other things. So we have the crystal staff. We don't meet the requirements for it. It requires 48 int. Okay. Sounds good. Um. Okay, well, let's look at these. So that's dagger. We don't have that much dex, I don't think. We do, actually. Okay, so that one, it's, it's quick step. Okay, we do more damage with our magic short sword. Not that much. And the dagger swings faster. So let's look at our spells. And memorize spells. So let's just look at what we have here. Arc is, we've had that. Earth Shatter. First step into the ground to emit a shockwave. Terra Magicus raises the magic strength of those within Sigil. Crystal Relief scours an area with violent rain of crystal shards. And that's it. Okay, well, we can look at... It could be useful to have if we wanted to be like a FF14 Black Mage. <laughs> Let's go check out Terra Magicus. Well, Earth, Earth Shatter. Oh, wait, what? No. Okay. Okay, so we can, we can do it twice. Okay, sounds... Okay. 
We have our weapon upgraded now, now. So that's useful. Where were we earlier? We were after... These guys? No, these guys. Yeah, the men are up a level. Before we're doing that, I'm going to just look up the entire reason we went to the manor actually which was the carrion piercer i didn't look up exactly where it is i just looked up that it, where it was so two drop scarab behind the gardens near the east Okay. So on the map, um, okay, which one of these is there? This one? There it is. So it seems to be there. So let's go up there. And see if we can see if we can find the carrion piercer. Oh yeah, we don't really want Earth Shadow, I don't think. So let's go with the Green Great Sword. We could go with some other ones. Our magicus could be okay. But we're gonna stay with a largely carrion. It's that way. A largely carrion build here. Yeah. It'd be there, there some way. I don't have any way to really get down there from here unless we just go down. I'm at a lower level. Yeah. Um hmm. Is that character bugging out? <laughs> Ah, uh, nice. We'll go see what's over there first. Now these wolves intermittently will dead angle you, which is great. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> the only appropriate response. <laughs> it's like, oh no, we're falling, put the game. <laughs> or if you're in co op on PC, you just hit Alt, alt F4. <laughs> so most people end up doing. I mean, there's no real need to anymore. No, no. Right, it sounds good. Alright, so let's get back here. Rest of this side race. And then... So what is the moveset like on this? Eh, pretty standard for it. A dagger. Okay. We got these toy air wolves. Okay. 
They seemed non-hostile last time, but they are uh, actually hostile. So, they are actually hostile. Yeah. We'll get it. Well, if we can get up there, we could possibly get across, but uh, like this. These wolves subsist on anyway. Uh, let's go to the gate. Let's go to the front gate, see if we can find a way over there from here. We went to the left, we never actually went to the right. I remember there were those big hands here. I don't think they actually get stunned by our air spells. It's a bit of a problem for me. Ah, uh, I see the one I'm after. Is he still after us? Or is he lost sight of us? I think he's lost sight of us. But I need to get over there. There. <laughs> we'll just reset them. <laughs> Because I never actually figured out how to fight those things. It was one of those things where I'm assuming they take reduced magic damage, so it was just easier. Okay. So, so he'll run the direction we want him to run. Instead of towards the hands that we can't fight, to uh, away from the hands we can't fight. <laughs> Just so we can get a new spell to look at. Okay, we got it. That doesn't matter if we ever die. What's this? Ice Crest Shield. Interesting. Okay, let's see. Okay, well, let's head up to this area where we can look at the boss, where, where we can fight the boss. We can also look at the carrion piercer. See how it deal, how it deals against mounted enemies. So first, we need to memorize the spell. Carrion piercer. Okay, and this one I think we can charge it. Yeah, I don't know if it does um, more damage on charge or not. I'm assuming it does. Oh, can we level up? We just went and fought a good number of enemies. Yes. Now we have essentially no real skull. No souls. So, no runes. So... Not too worried about that. Alright. Let's go one shot the boss, shall we? <clears throat> That'd be nice if the piercer causes the enemy to get staggered more more often. That would be nice. I doubt that is the case, but it would be nice. And now you. 
Yeah, so weapons all do different poise damage, so with a dagger, you're not going to stagger anyone. With a knife. Let's make our way to the boss fight. Hey. Does it matter? All we need to do is get into the boss fight. Hello, you're gonna do your old jumpy thing, right? Ow. Okay. I'm just curious as to if the knight can be stunned more often with the piercer or not. How much like stun damage the piercer does compared to other things, or if these even like do stun damage? Now, running out of mana hasn't really been the problem we've had. I think we're trying to do it when it's not a situation for it. But we can probably test it. To see if it's something that actually works, actually does stun damage. Because we can go over here and this guy's just hanging out. I didn't stun him, per se. Perfumer's bolts, huh? So it didn't stun him, it just did damage. So, thinking the Sloyson might be our better option here. Because we're going to do about the same amount of damage with carrying the Sloicer. Ah. Of course, another weapon is upgraded. Oh, nice. Now step is upgraded a little bit. We'll hopefully be doing more damage. I don't think we're doing that much more damage to him. Because when you upgrade the staffs, because they've... Because From has made it go from like plus 15 was the hard max to plus 25 now being the hard max. Plus 15 to plus 25. Well, and you got for you guys. For you guys, being plus, like, plus 15 to, like, plus 25, it's, like, things don't upgrade as much as you might think. <laughs> I think we went from, like, 57 to 69. Oh god, we didn't save a sneak.
Okay, let's go. Okay, we got a dodge. At about the right time. Oh no. Ah. Wait, we're gonna run that one too? Okay, nice. Need to heal. Okay, let's go. Two good hits. Gotcha. We respawn and you don't. Wait, <laughs> got him. Let's go pick up our stiff and go, uh, stuff, I guess. Go and, uh, do things. We have Lorietta's bow now, which is nice. There's a great arrow from a magic bow. Could be useful. What does it technically count as? Sorcerer used by Royal Nad Loretta. Creates a magic bow, a magic great bow, and fires a great arrow. Charging enhances potency. Hold to keep air hold to keep the arrow knocked. It is said that the bow is Loretta's favorite weapon. The slice over there. All right then. Okay, it's just a fire. Right. <laughs> okay, so charging charging it is the difference between three hundred and five hundred. So, holy crap, Fire calls way too much, though. <laughs> okay, so it costs 307. So it hit him for 307. And our adjust is that. So let's just assume he has magic defense. So let's just say it's times two for normal. Which would get us up to, well, let's just say it's 170, which would get us up to 340. And then charge it was like 500 something. Probably just times three. So, normal is probably times two, and charge is probably times three. Now let's test the great so I. Do you remember reading that the great sword that the uh, piercer isn't actually all that great? But let's test it. Let's just test it. Okay. 
because we are a carrion boy. Oh, did we not put the piercer on? We didn't put the piercer on. We are smart SMRT. Oh man, crank anchors. That show is so 90s. Very, very 90s. <laughs> If you don't know what Crank Anchors is, it's a uh, it's a puppet. Sh I think it was a puppet show from the '90s that just made fun of pretty much everything in a way that today would make people upset. So uncharged. Five thirty-nine. Charged. Ah. Charged. Ah. <laughs> there you go. That's that's how effective the carry piercer is. <laughs> You've seen it. <laughs> the carry and piercer. <laughs> and that's him, uh, that, that's 509 with him. Aware that you're there. Ooh, yeah, that's right. We shot him. And he was, um, was unaware of us. That means he would take extra damage. That's not necessarily good. Okay, so it was 509 with him unaware of us. Yeah, it increases damage a little bit. Not really enough to to justify much. Especially when I have to like charge it for so long. So we're gonna go back to the carrying smoisa and the carrying greatsword. Which is okay, but doesn't seem to be anything great. What is this? Try gesturing. Let there be something. Well, it looks like a big O, right? Let's let's go a big O, then let's go with that, I guess? Disparage this message. Maybe this will do something. I don't know if it will. But maybe. Okay, didn't do anything. What about Rapture? It's like sort of in that same symbol. No? Okay, sounds good. So the I know. Must be an item. No. No, it can't be an item. Seems to be something out there as well. Stomping our ends. So we murderize Loretta. And the knights of the round table. Dog. Could this be boss fight right after boss fight? Three sisters. Okay. Is there a dragon out there? It sort of looks like a dragon. Okay, so what is over here? Assume that dragon doesn't come over here. At the way as they're known. I think I said this before, dragons were known as, dragons are known as worms because well, runners rise. Who the hell is Rena? Is uh is Rena like that that blue girl? Blue Witch. Okay, well, let's go look at 
the other towers, if there's other towers near the dragon. Near the dragon has destroyed them. Maybe the dragon has left them intact. That's a worm, right? I mean, that's a, uh, it's a wyvern, right? I think it's a wyvern. Alright, let's go ahead and get on Torrent and look around here. Interesting looking. Those go down. Those looks like there's people or something down there in those beams. I'm not sure if there actually is. No, it might have just been an optical illusion. No, it looks like there's sh like crystals or something down there. So maybe those are the crystals that are the foundation of the weld. Let's see if we can circumvent this dragon for now. Well, who's gonna see us sort of going over here and be like, you what, mate? Granny's rise. Okay. Is there also in here? There's a set of grays, so that's usually a good sign. Uh, might be leading us over here. Let's look over here. <laughs> Behold, Overcast. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Behold. It's just a gloom. I mean, behold, welcome to Britain. <laughs> praise, praise the what? Praise the lover. Okay. That's good, I guess. Okay, so we can get a little bit higher. Let's see what we can do up here. And okay, I can swing, so that means I'm not necessarily safe from this character. Mm. A tarnished here. Thou must have some business in mind to come all this way. Though I have no memory of inking thee an invitation. No reason in particular thou claimest. Intriguing. Then mayhaps fate hath steered thee to this encounter. Mm. Wilt thou enter into my service? 